This is the Broadcast Almanac, a look at another important date in the history of broadcasting. I'm Dennis Daly. February 10, 1925, radio station WTIC in Hartford, Connecticut signs on. Soon it's giving a time signal every hour. People say the TIC in the call letters stood for the ticking of the clock. Actually, it stood for Travelers Insurance Company, the company that funded the station. Of course, we still have WWV and WWVH broadcasting the time for the federal government. Those stations transmit from Colorado and Hawaii on short wave, and they even have double ticks on certain minutes. Those ticks indicate whether the time is fast or slow. The Broadcast Almanac for February 10th. I'm Dennis Daly.